What is up? It's Max Jam. My dog is walking into my bed. That's why you can hear him. Uh, we back. We made it to the moon. Uh, right, let's, let's Hello? Hello? Oh, so, so Sarah already made it here. No, nothing. This can't be right. I'll go downstairs, see what I can find. Sarah, we'll figure this one out. And thank you, both of you, for saving me when the blackout hit. I know I am. Um... team, you must be at the surface by now. Remember, you only have 40 minutes down there. Copy that, Pearson. Don't mention it, Rolf. Can you check out the control center and see what's wrong with the MPT? Will do. Keep your comms on. I'll update you when I find something. All right, cool. I'm not reading that shit. All right, let's 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 go finish this. Let's go and do this shit. Hey, what was that? Speech, whatever. I don't care about that shit. Let's go over here. Ah, uh, is it? It's in here. All right. William, what the hell was that speech about? Our next chapter, Rosa. It's time. The ship will be ready soon. You can't be serious. I don't know how you plan to fix this mess, but you'd better do it now. That won't be necessary. Come with me. You are serious. Will, have you lost your mind? We can't leave the colony behind like this, not during this blackout. Not with the MPT signal still offline. People on Earth depend on us. Don't concern yourself with them. Those days are over. We have to start the long journey ahead. That was the agreement. The ships were supposed to be our last resort. We didn't give up the first time, and we're not giving up now. When the network is back online, we can provide Earth with power again. We are close, William. No, we're not. We're not close at all. If you still think we can power the entirety of Earth with the MPT, you're more delusional than I thought. We have one last hope, and it's outward. Now get ready, because we're going. I'm not leaving, Will. Not like this. I'm not asking. Get her on the ship. What? Damn. Uh, is this really... <sighs> Damn, I'm so forceful. Picked them up. I don't know what to do. Why do I pick them up? Am I supposed to go in here? I I think I re do I remember this? Am I supposed to have him? Uh yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember this. I remember this. Alright, yeah, I know what to do. Real, real, real simple. So like literally he's the first thing I have ever pretty much used in a while, like for real. Alright, I ain't gonna lie, I, I know what to do. Let's go in here.
supposed to go up here, around, over, and down. Hit the left, hit the down, hit the up, hit the left. Go in here. And he's supposed to interact. And then enter interact. I don't know what that did, but it worked. This is Isaac. Hi. I'm not sure if this message will ever reach you. I, uh, I don't think it will. But I'm trying anyway. We haven't spoken since the arguments about Kathy. I want you to know that she's safe and well. This message will be the last you'll ever get from me or from anyone else up here. It's probably something you'll never understand. <laughs> Hell, I barely do. If someone ever finds out what happened here, know that I did it for her. For your sister. To give her a chance. <laughs> but you'll do great. <clears throat> you'll do great things. Take care. And, uh... I love you. I wish I said that more often. <laughs> Back when you still called me dad. Goodbye, Claire. Okay. Let me see what I do. Okay, go to the E. I keep saying E and P. The MPT Control Center. Okay. That's my next mission. That's what I'm supposed to do. Um, I'll still I'll make sure I'll let you guys know. Um the part where I left off that. I went in here and I did this, this that little thing. Let me just knock this out real quick. Can you hear me from here? Oh yeah. Yeah. 100 percent yeah. Fuck out of there. Okay, let me give you Let me give you guys a little hint, real quick. Uh, let me let me do this. Come in, Rolf. I'm at the quarters. Do you read me? Copy that, Sarah. I hear you. Anything interesting? Everything's deserted, so nothing new here. Sarah, Rolf, this is Pearson Control. Our time's running out. Take the elevator back up here to make it in time for evacuation. You've got two minutes. Negative control. MPT network is still offline. Leave it. We have to go. Head to the elevator now. I'm not putting anyone at risk. Understood. Wrapping up now. Sarah, you heard control. Are you almost here? Sarah, come in. Everything okay? Come in. Rolf, get over here quickly. An AZ unit just activated, but something's not right. The doors are locked behind me. What do you mean? We've got to go. I'm serious, Rolf. Get over here. I can't get out. Negative control. Engineer Baker requires immediate assistance. We need more time. Negative. I'm calling up the elevator now. Negative control. Control. No, guys. There's still time. We just need some help. Rolf, are you still there? Damn. It just left their ass. Okay. Let me give you guys a little secret. So. Uh, I spent uh, quite a lot of time in this uh, 
guess like a bed bedding area bedroom area i don't know and they kept saying the password is the the year to date whatever right the password it's right here i didn't know this 2032 i remember that shit i read it somewhere it's in one of these shits that i read watch the password is 2032 i bet you guys so dude 2032 i told you it took me a long time to get basically to get through that That bitch is facing me. Please. I cannot get hit again. Turn your ass. Oh. Been there. See, has S2. Yeah. Oh, it's a cruise quarantine. So this is how you get into the vehicle bay. There you go. Two seconds, right? I think the vehicle bay is awesome, to be honest. I drove I drove around a little bit, but I didn't really drive around like that. Alright, so let's get let's get a vehicle. I'm just gonna get him. That's Viper right here. I should get this Viper right here. Look at this. This is awesome. We better go out into spice. Oh, this this game look just look at this game bro this game is amazing look at this let's think about this I think I spent like 30 maybe like twenty dollars on this game I'm fu I'm freaking driving on the moon at this point this is a twenty dollar game I'm driving on the moon my third dollar game just look at this look at this you cannot get no better than this So after actually after I do this, I um everything else is new. Um, I've never tried before, so I'm supposed to connect. That's what it is. I'm connecting to the satellite. I don't know. To this thing. Do you think I really know what's going on? No. I'm trying to get the MTP online. If that works, then that works. If it don't, then it don't. Oh, I just hit a big Irish rock. So right now we're going to the other side. Uh, to, I guess to do the same thing. Once we go over here to do this. Shush. Once we go over here. To do whatever we got to do. Literally after that, um, that's basically where I stopped at. So we made it to the other one. I think when I sit on this thing, it gives me oxygen. I guess like they have oxygen tanks on the seat. Yeah.
Okay. As you can tell, I got an achievement. As you can tell, I didn't do it. I didn't do it. So this is new. This is definitely new for me. I think it's kind of actually pretty cool that I can drive in here. I mean, uh, oh, kind of like goes kind of fast. Park this baby back in there, you know what I'm saying? Maybe I should just check this real quick and yeah, figure out what's going on first. Not established. No incoming MPT signal diagnosis in between. Nothing. I'm not getting nothing. It's still offline. Back and power the station. Oh, that's working. I know what that is. <laughs> Might have to take a ride on that shit. All right, but first we're gonna see what that little floating, floating orange thing is. Today, today we find ourselves at a crossroads. The catastrophic events that have unfolded at the Tombo facility have opened our eyes to the truth that cannot be denied. We have lost friends, colleagues. Our fellow colonists gave their lives for a hopeless cause, for a dying planet that we could never sustain. We used to call it home, our pale blue dust. But the Earth we know today is a willing process, a shadow of its former self. The MPT chained us to a barren rock. But no more. All of you gathered here are survivors. You're here because you're mankind's strongest, the smartest, the brightest. Together, we will dare to lead and risk greatness. Start a new age of discovery. Like our ancestors in that faithful moment, they first set out to explore new worlds. We can turn back and confine ourselves to a dying planet. Or we can look outward. Now is the time to act. Make your decision and make it now. A new beginning dawns for humanity. And it dawns today. Before I do it, let me watch this. What was that speech all about? MacArthur can't decide this on his own now, can he? Look, we don't call the shots here, okay? Now help me out with this stuff. Put that down, Frank. Don't you know what helium is for? Don't you think it's strange it's here instead of next to the reactor it's supposed to power? Of course I do, it's just a... Just what? Should we accept everything they say? Do you even realize what the consequences are if we leave while the MPT is offline? What choice do we have? What do we really have to go back to? Floods, dust storms, blazing heat? I'm done. The council's giving us a second chance, and I'm not wasting it. Now I'm done talking. Just give me a hand. Facts. Big facts. Did they drive this shit? Oh. Yo, know, they picked the wrong person to do this.
This is Sarah Baker, lead engineer at Pearson Space Station. I was sent to investigate the blackout together with station mechanic Rolf Robertson. I was attacked by an AZ unit and lost consciousness. The reasons for this attack remain unclear. It seems my expedition partner has left. And I am unable to contact Pearson Space Station or any of the other facilities. I'm going to cross the frontier now, passing Copernicus Outpost 1, to get to Tombo and try to figure out what caused the impact Tombo. failure. Whoever finds this, please try to contact me. Okay, Alex, I will. And recording. We gotta start. I, I, you're Alex. You are Alex. I gotta find Sarah, I think it is. What that fucking password is. Investigate why the moon rail has stopped. Are we not at Tombo? Frank Frank has the code. Okay. This is an evacuation. The reactor at Tombo has suffered a critical malfunction. We're here to evacuate you to Copernicus Moon Hub. Whoa, calm down. Who sent you? We're here on official orders of the Lunar Council. The Lunar Council? Frank, did you see anything strange happening across the MPT network? Mm, I've got nothing out of the ordinary. Tombo seems fine to me. Perhaps you could explain a bit more first. This is for your own safety. The situation will be explained by the council when all colonists arrive at Moon Hub. So, MacArthur calls the shots now, huh? We don't have time for this. Just take them. What? Get your hands off me! Evacuation crew to MacArthur. We're progressing to stage two. Outpost crew and the package are on their way to Moon Hub. We didn't receive any word from the others at Reinhold, though. Good work, evac. Wait for them to pass Outpost 1. Contact me again when the second evacuation crew arrives. Over and out. I gotta find Frank. Frank was over here. <laughs> yeah, I gotta get in there somehow. Let's go over here real quick. This is Pearson Station Engineer Sarah Baker again. I traveled to this outpost from Moon Hub, where I was sent to investigate the blackout together with my expedition partner. Moon Hub was completely deserted when we arrived, and we were unable to bring the MPT back online. We got separated and lost contact. Yeah. I'm traveling towards Tombo alone to continue my investigation. The only lead I have is that something has happened at the reactor facility. The entrance to the monorail station here is blocked. So I have to find another way to cross the landscape. It's worth a shot. Hello. I was like, yeah, why would I need to grab this? I, I pressed the wrong button, guys. I know where's the way to go. I'm guessing it's just one way, so hope they don't got something where it's like six or seven different ways. I will be pissed. One eight eight one. It's 
station still up? Why? Why? Hey, well, then now this is open. So many different things. It's helium. Those are those heliums. They, why do they put it in here? Okay. What is up here? Ah, oh, I know what it was. What Evacuation happened. crew to MacArthur. Helium package and Copernicus outpost one personnel have arrived in Moonhub, sir. Evac crew two is still nowhere in sight, though. We've been trying to reach them, but we're getting no response at all. How should we proceed? Seal the door and make your way to Muna. Fuel needs to be in place before we arrive with the Tomboy evacuees. Sir, the other crew won't make it in time if I do that. They'll miss the launch. They know what they signed up for. Seal the door, now. Yes, sir. I, don't, I gotta do something. I gotta use the uh I gotta use Alex. I can't I don't think I can go out there. I don't think I have enough air. Three, right? Let's check. Let's check. <laughs> Your boy is smart. I gotta do something with this. Okay, that's cool. That's all I have to do is just turn it on, and then I'm good to go. No, I didn't have to go out there, but I did. That's cool. Damn, like we on the ground. Track access denied. Communication with closest base operator offline. Consult operator on arrival in Rhinold Crater Base. What does that mean? One combo track not switch tracks to avert fatal collision. Oh, 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 I missed it. I didn't even hold my controller. To avert fatal collision. Oh shit. Damn. I didn't even have my controller in my hand the first time. Fuck. Oh my god. Oh! Oh my goodness. Oh shit. Oh my god. Fucking come on, come on. Sheesh. Perfect. That's literally perfect. Like, shoo. She oh my gosh. But guys, I'm gonna end the gameplay right there. Thank you guys for tuning in. I am out. All right. Peace. <laughs>